Ben Tracker is back in the field today. Uh, back behind them, in fact, he's last of all in the early stages. How well, lad, the Whitbread Gold Cup winner going on here from Banjo in second place, two or three lengths away. Here's Earth uh, in third place. Here's General Wolf followed by Northern Lad. Half a length away, then Earth Summer, three parts further back in the field, then is Simply Dashing, followed by You Deep. Further back on the outside is Strathroyal and Indian Tracker held up at the rear. First of 18 down the back, and the leaders sail over it. On the inside, Howell Lad by half a length of Banjo. Three lengths further back in third is Sir Northern Lad. Followed then on the outside by General Wolf as they come to the second. On the inside, You Deep is next in the field, followed by Earth Summit and Simply Dashing. Two lengths back in the field is Strathroyal at this stage, and last of all is Indian Tracker. Coming towards the third, and Howell Lad on the inside sails over it in the lead. On the outside, Banjo running second out wider general wolf taking closer order in third they're two lengths in advance of uh, earth summit in the center as they come to the fourth followed then by northern lad back in the field then as you deep traveling on the inside of simply dashing a long gap then to Strathroyal as they head now towards the first of the ditches and last of all is indian tracker Coming to number five, the ditch now, and how well that jumped it well. Banjo took a, a big lump out of the center of that, but otherwise got away with it okay. In third place is General Wolf, wider out. Now that lad jumped it in fourth. Two lengths then, the Worth Summit, the Yellow Sleeves in fifth, followed then by Simply Dashing, and further back is You Deep as they prepare to lead the back now. Just behind You Deep at this stage follows uh, Indian Tracker and Strath Royal as they round the home turn and head up towards five obstacles in the home straight the first time. How well that on the far side is the leader. Banjo with the blinkers in the center is second. Followed then by Northern Lad in third over on the far side. General Wolf just shading him now on the near side. Yellow cap. Two lengths further back is Earth Summit. Followed then by on the outside simply dashing. Two lengths to you deep. Two lengths back in the field is uh, Indian Tracker. And then on the outside Strath Royal as they head up now to number seven. Banjo now showing out in the center takes it up clearly by two or three lengths as how well that has dropped back very sharply and in fact he's dropped back to last something obviously amiss with him heading up now towards the eighth and Banjo in the center is the leader by about a length or so to Worth Summit on the near side then over on the far side is Northern Lad again shaded by General Wolf on the near side Back in the field then as you deep followed by simply dashing Strathwell and Indian Tracker and how well that has tailed off. Heading now towards this open ditch in front of the stands and Banjo the first to rise on the far side gets over it by a length and a half to General Wolf in second. Half a length or so as they come to the water is Earth Summit who's taking closer water. Behind them is simply dashing from Northern Lad and Indian Tracker then Strathwell behind them and you deep getting reminders is last of all and Howell Lad has been pulled up in fact he was uh, pulled up pulled himself up before the ditch in front of the stands just getting into the course a bit as they head down the back and Banjo is the leader by a length and a half to Earth Summit in second half a length away then General Wolf in third one length behind them is Strath uh, this stage now than that followed by simply dashing two lengths you deep followed back in the field uh, by at this stage Indian Tracker and then Strath Royal heading towards number 11 now and in the center it's Earth Summit who ranges up to tackle uh, Banjo for the lead he's been ridden along Banjo now behind them is General Wolf followed by simply dashing who's hard on the heels as they come to the 12th behind them is Northern Lad who's starting to move into it now with keen interest followed then by uh, Strathwell who's taking closer order Indian Tracker is now starting to make ground as the race starts to unfold and Earth Summit now hits the front simply dashing has dropped right out the back and company with you deep Heading down now towards five out, and the leader on the far side, General Wolf, has now ranged up to uh, Earth Summit on the near side. They touch down almost together. Northern Lad coming there with renewed interest on the near side, followed then by Strath Royal as they prepare to leave the back now and come to this open ditch four out. It's Earth Summit, the first to rise in the center, but shaded there by General Wolf, a better jump, and Northern Lad is still there. Behind them is Strath Royal being ridden along now with the whip followed by simply dashing who's also getting reminders as they prepare to lead the back but here it is out in front on the far side the yellow cap of general wolf just shading now the
Southern Lad, the near side Black Cap. Here comes Simply dashing around them on the outside has found a second wind. Followed then by Earth Summit who's dropped away from Indian Tracker who's still held up. And further back then is Strathwell, a long gap to Banjo Udeep who have dropped right out. Coming towards three out as they straighten now. It's General Wolf who's first over. From on the far side, Northern Lad on the near side, simply dashing. Behind them is Earth Summit, followed by Indian Tracker, who's now under the whip from Strathwell. But General Wolf is going great guns. He careers away, coming to the second last. He's four or five lengths in front. General Wolf comes towards it now, jumps it a little bit awkwardly. Sailing over it in second was Northern Lad, followed then by Simply Dashing, who's now under pressure. And further back is Strathwell, Indian Tracker, and Earth Summit. Udeep has been pulled up a long gap then the banjo coming towards the last it's general wolf five in front draws towards it now and lands over it safely jumps it well a long way clear of northern lad giving chase followed by simply dashing then strathwell as they come up towards the elbow now the leader is general wolf the jumping's all over he's five or six in front northern lad coming home like a train from strathwell and further back is simply dashing but general wolf with a hundred yards left to go is safely holding them at bay it's general wolf Wolf is going to go on and win the Peter Marsh by about five lengths. A Strathwell gets up for second. Northern Lad is third. A long gap then to simply dashing fourth. Followed then by Indian Tracker. Earth Summit has dropped right back to uh, finish a long way behind the winner. And Banjo is the last to complete the course. Udeep was pulled up. Well, the winner is number seven. A General Wolf owned by the winning line Racing Limited, uh, trained by Captain Tim Forster and ridden by Norman Williamson, who had that heavy fall earlier today, but he's come back to win the big one. Second is number nine, Strathroyal, owned by Lady Anne Bentick, trained by Owen Brennan, ridden by Martin Brennan. And third, number five, Northern Lad, owned by Jay Shaw, trained by Jenny Pittman and ridden by Dennis Leahy. And as you can see there, Norman Williamson looking in a good deal of pain as he comes back on this 11-2 winner, General Wolf, fourth in the race, simply dashing, and fifth was Indian Tracker. But the winner of the Peter Marsh is on your screen now, General Wolf. Yeah, a great performance by this horse. He obviously likes his track. He saved his best running four round here because sometimes he makes the odd mistake. Uh, there, uh, simply dashing would be in the, sort of had reminders along the back, and then he came back under the bridle for Lorcan Wire. Nathan Northern Lad on the inside. He finished galloping, as did uh, Strathroyal under Martin Brennan, who's going to make a mistake at the last. But Norman's really made this horse's mind up. I mean, he's jumped very well, in fact, better than I've seen him jump for a while. Uh, the winner there, General Wolf. What did you make of Richard? But, Skew, when you consider what a kicking this boy had in the first race, and he's picked himself up to come out and give this the mother and father of a ride, the horse does act round here. He stayed well. His run behind Sunny Bay was good, and he's shown that his newbie running was, was not right. But this is a staying performance, but Narthen Lad also, good Grand National trial there, and Strath Royal just continues to improve. That's right. A, a, a very good race. I think we'll see uh, there'll be some pointers for races... Uh, in the future. Yes, and you can see what...